What is up you guys? It's me, Galen Larice, and welcome back to another stretch video here on my channel. Today's stretch routine is really special because it is the third in my five day stretch challenge that I'm hosting right here on my channel, where you can join me for a new flexibility stretch routine every day this week in celebration of my tickets for the body and mind stretch retreat finally being for sale. That's right, for three days and two nights, I'll be hosting an intensive dancer stretch techniques program in an all-inclusive retreat to help you gain a deeper understanding of the body science and technical dance practices behind the stretches that I share here on YouTube. A lot of you guys have been telling me you want to expand your dance community, you want to increase your flexibility, or you just want to better understand how your body works. So if any of that is you, then this retreat is where you need to be, okay? I can't wait to work with some of you guys in person, sip some hot chocolate, share some laughs, and just enjoy this transformational three-day experience with you guys. So I will have that link down below in the description box for more information in case you want to join me. I love seeing you guys do my stretch routines on Instagram, so share your posts of you doing the five day stretch challenge and don't forget to tag me at galen.laris so I can give you a little shout out. For the stretch routine, you will need a wall for stability and a towel for the first stretch. So once you've grabbed one, go ahead and fold it into a roll and let's begin. For our first stretch, we are going to do some demi point pulses. Find a stable place on your towel by tapping your foot and when you found a nice stable spot, press over your foot into a demi-point position with your weight over your second and third toes. In this position, I want you to point your ankle forward like you're going to point your toes so that your arch engages in your foot. And then, release it. We'll continue these pulses on one foot for 30 seconds, and then on the other. Ready? Set. For the other side. Ready? Set. Go. job. Now let's gently stretch out our lower calf muscles or our soleus muscles and our Achilles with some deep ankle pedals. With a gentle bend in the knees, keep your weight over your toes to gently press into your feet to give your ankles a nice stretch. If you take a deep breath and exhale, you should feel yourself gently sink further into the stretch. We'll continue these for one minute. Ready? Set. Let's do some extended knee drops. You're going to face the wall with your hips level and your foot extended behind you on its highest releve. 
Then simply drop your knee so you shift your weight in your hips and then extend to a full high demi point behind you again. You should feel the stretch behind the toes on the bend and work your calves up to the glutes on the extension. We'll do these for 30 seconds on each side. Ready, set, go. And now for the other side. Ready? Go. Those can be kind of tricky to get situated in, but I promise you will feel them tomorrow. Next, let's go into a toe stretch on the wall. With lifted ankles, simply push forward until your knees are perpendicular to the wall, meaning that you're making a right angle with the wall and your knee. Then simply rest your forearms on the wall. We'll stay here for 30 seconds. Ready, set. Great. I know those can be hard if you have trouble really bending in the feet. So if you did it, I'm proud of you. Now make your way to the floor sitting facing the wall with a slight arch in your lower back and your neck long. Flex your feet in front of you and pull your toes back while keeping your knees as straight as possible. You should feel the stretch behind the legs from the lower calves all the way up to your glutes. We'll stay here for 30 seconds. Ready? Set, go. an ankle stretch. I want you to sit on your feet again, but this time with your ankles pushing all the way forward and your hands resting behind you. Be sure to keep your neck long here. Pushing your knees down or lifting them up while pushing through the ankles will help you control how much weight is over your toes. We'll stay here for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Nice, you guys, and let's come up to standing for our last two exercises. The first are tendu points. Simply point your foot forward toward the wall with a straight knee, then relax the toes, and then fully point again. 
You should really, really feel this in your calves, especially in that top muscle on your calves called the gastroc. We'll continue these for 30 seconds on each side. Ready, set, go. for the other side. Ready, set, go. Great, you guys, and for our final strength exercise, we're going to do some simple coupe passes with one hand on the wall. Releve onto your toes, and then lift to coupe. Make sure that that knee is nice and straight and you're really pulled up in that heel. Then go to passe, meaning that your foot is now by your knee. Then back down to coupe, and then down with both legs parallel in releve. And now you're gonna do the other side. This will work the stirrup muscles along the sides of your ankles that keep your ankle stable. We will continue these for one minute, and then you will have completed this entire routine. Ready, set, go. <laughs> And that is it you guys, you just completed my ankle stretch and strength routine. If you want another video like this one, I have another one just like this, so I'll be sure to link it up top for you guys because you guys really loved that ankle stretch and strength routine. If you enjoyed this routine, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to join me tomorrow for day four of my five day stretch challenge. Tomorrow we'll be chilling it out with a nice simple morning stretch routine. And of course, if you are looking to get more of this stretchy goodness, then go ahead and check the link in my description box for more information on the body and mind stretch retreat. I'll see you guys with a new stretch video tomorrow. Later.